the paintwork of the body is quite delicate. As a result, chips and scratches appear even from a slight impact on the paint. Most often, the hood is prone to chipping, because of this, on most specimens, it is not in its native paint. As for the quality of the body metal, it suffers considerably in our operating conditions, especially in the places of chips. The most susceptible to corrosion, the hood, trunk lead, upper and lower edges of the door, seals and wheel arches. On prestyle inversions, the seams and floor of the trunk, the bottom of the car and suspension elements, covered with rust, require special attention. Not famous for durability and chrome plate body elements, cloudy and corroded. Also, on a car older than 6 years, the front optics begin to become cloudy. To prolong the life of the optics, it is enough to stick a protective film on it. The weak points include the windshield, quickly covers with chips and stretches, cracking with a sharp temperature drop, and door handles. When the door freezes, it will not be difficult to break the handle. This second-generation Nissan Tiana was equipped with only gasoline engines, an inline 4, 2.5, 167 horsepower, and V-sharp 6s with a volume of 2.5, 182 horsepower, and 3.5, 249 horsepower. All power units are quite reliable, but V6 engine deserves the most attention, as they are considered the most successful in the last decade. The declared resource of V6 engine is 300-350,000 km, but as operating experience has shown, with proper maintenance and proper operation, the motor, without major repairs, can last up to 500,000 km. The main problems that owners face are often associated not with the power unit itself, but with its attachments. So, for example, in winter there are problems with the cold start of the engine due to the fragility of the catalyst. It is not worth delaying the replacement of catalysts, since when it is destroyed, ceramic particles enter the cylinder and significantly reduce the piston resource for 60,000 km. To extend the life of the pump, it is necessary to change the oil at least once every 10-15,000 km, especially if the car is operated in urban mode. The official service recommends installing expensive iridium candles on the motor, but this makes no sense, since they do not last much longer than ordinary ones. Owners of cars with a 3.5 engine often have to change engine mounts every 40-50 thousand kilometers, while owners of cars with a 2.5 engine carry out this procedure every 150-100 thousand kilometers. These motors are equipped with a timing chain drive. As a rule, this unit does not require intervention up to 170 to 100,000 km. Replacement of the chain and tensioners is required. The common disadvantages of this motor include a small resource of timing chains, a phase shifter and an oil pump. They fail at a range of 120-150 thousand km. The piston group at high millage is prone to cocking. As a result, the engine begins to eat up oil. Of the common features of all engines, oil leaks through the cylinder head gasket can be noted. After 120-150 thousand kilometers, oil consumption increases. Replacement of piston rings is required. Also, one should take into account the fact that the engine are not equipped with hydraulic compensators and require valve adjustment at least once every 70-90 thousand kilometers. If at idle the engine begins to triple and acceleration occurs with jerks, flushing of the nozzles and throttle valve is required. If this does not fix the problem, you will have to reflash the engine control unit. All power units are afraid of overheating. In order to avoid big troubles, many experts recommend changing the thermostat every 50-60 thousand kilometers, fail on a run of up to 80 thousand kilometers, and flushing the radiator one two times a year. On pressed island specimens, engine sensors, lambda sensors, and temperature sensors require special attention, and wiring damage is also encountered. Radiator fans are considered one of the problem areas. Both their bearings and electric drive fail, so be sure to check their performance when buying. It is not worth counting on a long line of transmission service, since its resource, on average, is 150-170 thousand kilometers. Even regular replacement of branded lubricants does not help. A repair only briefly extends the life of the transmission, therefore, many experts recommend changing the box immediately. Most often, owners of post-styling copies face a variator malfunction. The fact is that the manufacturer made structural changes of the box cooling system, removing one of the three radiators. As a result, the unit overheats under a prolonged load. In cars on which the box was overheated, at high engine speeds, the transmission holes and twitches during acceleration. The oil in the box should be changed at least once every 30,000 km, otherwise premature wear of the oil pump and valve body plungers is inevitable. Often, for a run of 100,000 km, on cars whose owners like to light up, you have to change the belt. In all-wheel drive versions, the clutch of the rear-wheel drive clutch is added to the number of nodes with a limited resource, which can be burned with frequent arrivals on ice or races in the summer. For replacing the clutch, you will have to pay 6800 USD. Nissan Tiena 2 suspension is independent, without any complex design solution – McPherson front, multi-link rear. If we talk about its reliability, then, despite its simplicity, a couple of weak points are still present in it. 
Most often, stabilizer struts and bushings bother replacement every 20-30 thousand kilometers. Once every 40-60 thousand kilometers, tire rod ends remind of themselves. On a run of 80-100 thousand kilometers, more serious cost will be required, since by this time the ball bearings, steering rod, silent blocks of the front levers and rear suspension levers are out of order. Shock absorbers, support and wheel bearings can last up to 150 thousand kilometers. When operating a car, it is necessary to monitor the ailment, because in Tiana it regularly goes astray, check every 10-15 thousand kilometers. In the steering mechanism, the power steering mechanism most often bothers. The problem is that the high-pressure hose is close to the exhaust manifold, due to overheating it starts to crack and leak, replacing the hose on average costs 200-250 USD. There are also complaints about the steering rack. Problems with the rack can begin at a range of 70-80 thousand kilometers. Smudges and knocking appear when driving on road roads. The braking system as a whole is reliable, except that on vehicle with all-wheel drive you can find increased wear on the front brake hoses. The quality of the finishing materials for the Nissan Tiana 2 interior does not quite correspond to the class of the car. A torn driver's seat is more the rule than the exception, and even the threads of the seams literally spread with the high mileage. Closer to 100,000 km, scuffs appear on the steering wheel. It is also frustrating that the steering wheel does not have reach adjustment, and the monochrome display on the audio system in basic configurations the same one was installed on Opel 10 years ago. And here, the sound quality of acoustics and noise isolation pleasantly surprised, but nevertheless, it still does not reach the premium level of European models. There are almost problems with the electrics. Most often, the owners complain about the failure of the power window control unit, malfunctions of the multimedia system and errors in the operating of the climate system often occur. In most cases, flashing blocks is required to fix problems. When inspecting a car with a mileage of 150,000 km or more, listen to how the motor works. If there are extraneous noises, then it will have to be changed soon. If you are the owner of this car model, please describe the problems that you had to face during the operation of the car. Perhaps it is your review that will help readers of our site when choosing a car.